There's anger in Rankin County over a recent item in a local newspaper. WJTV 12's Linnea Lewis spoke with a woman who says what was published was racist. She says there's a line between freedom of speech and hate speech. Linnea. Bonnie Strickland says she looked at the Rankin County News this past week and read something she calls racist. I sat down and spoke with Bonnie and others in the area about how they feel about the column. Rankin County News has served Rankin County for the past 171 years, but not everyone is too happy with a recent publication. Bonnie Strickland, who's lived in the area for two years, says she was shocked by a section in the Dear Ann column. Other people can write in their opinions, and I saw that there was some very disturbing um, opinions written there. What she read was this first piece that reads in part, Dear broke my heart, it is true that as soon as the first black family moved into our neighborhood, it only took days before houses started having for sale signs pop up. The second piece read, Dear killed Jackson, you can call me racist all you want, but the truth is Jackson didn't start to go down until the blacks took over. Strickland explained the newspaper should have never published the content. I think is wrong. I don't think that should be any kind of language or speech like that should be out there. Um, I would, like I said, I would hate for my children or neighbors or someone to read that and feel um, like they're not included or that they're not important. I took to the streets of Rankin County to see how others in the community felt about the recent publication. It has opened I, my eyes, but no, I think that that was a very, very racist one-sided opinion. Everyone should be able to express what they feel with the understanding that people may have opposite opinions and feelings, but that's no reason to get upset about it. I spoke to the editor of Rankin County News, and he said in part, these are just opinions that writers write in. It's both black and white that write in. We don't believe in racism, but the article is what people say and feel. They, people can write back here to respond.